today I want to show you the actual supplies that we use for all the painting tutorials that we do on this channel. So I wanted to first show you the types of paints that I use. So the paints that I actually end up using are from the company Liquitex and uh, these are the Liquitex Basic Value Series. I am a huge fan of these. This is the matte finish. So they are perfect for any artist that is beginning or an artist that has been doing painting for a couple of years, but is still not a complete like expert. And the uh, paint colors that I always end up using are a titanium white, a primary red, Mars black, primary blue, and primary yellow. These five colors are the only colors that I ever use in all of my videos. I will include a link to these in the description below. Primarily the two types of canvas that I really like to use for my videos. This one is an 8x10 pre-gessoed canvas and this one is an 11 by 14 pre-gessoed canvas. So when I say pre-gessoed, that just means that there has been a compound called gesso, which is primarily white acrylic paint that has already been put on to this stretched canvas. So this helps the fabric to hold on to the acrylics and not absorb right through. So you really get that nice vibrant color. I will also include a link to this, these canvases in the description below. And last but not least, I tend to use either three to four different types of brushes depending on the video. Most of these brushes, as you can see, is from a company called Simply Simmons. Uh, I recently discovered them and I am very, very happy with these brushes. One of the things I guess that I liked about these brushes is the spring back of the bristles. So you can hear the spring back. I don't know if you can hear that. You want this kind of a spring back when it comes to handling acrylics on a canvas because there's a lot of friction when you're taking acrylic to your canvas. So you want to have a brush that can withstand that friction and be able to very evenly carry that paint. I think Simply Simmons does a very good job. Also, their handles are plastic, which is a huge plus. I don't like working with wooden handle brushes because they end up getting warped over time. And the types of brushes that I use from Simply Simmons is a three quarter inch flat wash brush, a number 10 filbert, sometimes I use this brush, not often, this is a number 10 shader brush, a number three round detail brush. And if I really wanna go into more detail, I don't have the F Simply Simmons version of this, but sometimes I like to use a number zero detail round brush. This is the actual palette I use, it's plastic, so um, I end up having to reuse this. And I kind of like this because I don't have to throw away plates, I don't waste, um, all I have to do is just clean the paints out. And because it's plastic, it the paints come out pretty easily. I, I just left these on for a longer time than I should have, so they kind of stuck, but if I scrub these, these will come out. So these are the types of materials that I like to use for all of my paintings. These do not change. What you see in front of you is what I use. So I'll include a link to all of these items that I use for my videos in the description below. I will let you know that the links that I will provide you are affiliate links, meaning that if you wanna support this channel and kinda of say a little thank you, you can just go through those affiliate links in my description, no extra cost to you. You'll be paying the same amount if you go on your own or with my links, except that I do get a little kick kickback as a way for Amazon and for you to all to say thank you. If you're new to my channel and you found this helpful, please be sure to like this video and to subscribe to my channel so you can see more videos from me in the future. All right, everyone. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Ta-ta!